What is going on guys and welcome back to another video. So today's video is very different, okay? And it's gonna happen over a number of weeks because we're getting our garden redone. The whole thing is gonna get redesigned just because Joshua wasn't happy with the playing surface, were you? No, no, we want the best for Joshua. No, it's not just for him. I wanna be able to film football videos out here and it's been a bit problematic and we want just a really nice garden to be honest. We've been working on it for the last kind of couple of months, um, saving up some money and um, it's gonna be amazing. So here's what the current state of the garden looks like. So we took the old conservatory down, which used to be here, and then we built this little extension there, which looks really cool and it just like extends out um, from the kitchen diner, which makes that a really nice space. And then at the minute, it's just kind of all overgrown and doesn't really look very good. And I've just started to take the fence down. This is the first stage, okay? Everything's getting ripped out. Like the fence, as you can see, is all coming out. I'm doing that myself to help the person doing it. All down here is just so overgrown. Like look at this grass. It's ridiculous. I can't play football on this. So that's all getting ripped out. And this is the new fence in here, composite fence in which we're getting put in. The sheds go in. Everything you can see right now is going to be gone. Other than Joshua, he, he's going to be staying. It's all right. This is all getting broken up and getting moved. The patio is all getting redone. The grass is getting completely redone. We're having artificial grass put in. And it's going to be pretty awesome. I'm going to be able to play football on this all year round. It's all getting completely leveled because it's not a good playing surface at the minute. And it's actually quite dangerous. I cannot wait to show you the progress. I can't wait to show you what it's going to look like at the end. What did I say? What did I say? Don't touch the sharp nails. So why are you, why are you touching them? So as you can see, work is well and truly underway. All of the fencing has been removed and the new fence posts and concrete gravel boards have all gone in. You can have a look here and see what it's kind of going to look like. Composite fencing, the way forward. I'm never ever going to have to paint a fence again, which is good news. They've also brought in the digger, which is just here. I really should probably get on this, shouldn't I? Do some skills. Maybe I'll do that for you later in the video. Hit like if you want to see that. The leveling the whole thing out, as you can see, it's a lot more level than it was. There was a massive dip here before. So they're building up this whole area. And down here, if we go and have a look, 40 tons of hardcore is coming in to build up this whole level so that it's perfectly flat and it's going to make the best football pitch possible. Even just the fact there's not that massive like foot drop there before. They've already started to build all this up and I can already really begin to imagine what it's gonna be like. The finished article is gonna be so awesome. They're gonna bring in the sleepers and they're gonna come across here to create that drop down level into this kind of nice patio area here as well. I've still got to get rid of that shed and move out all of this stuff so they can begin to work here. But it's coming along nicely. Couldn't fit the digger in, could they? So they had to <laughs> take the door off. That's fine, I'm sure it'll go back on at the end. Just went in and then I spotted that. That is perfect for a trick shot. Let me get a ball. Yeah. <laughs> you know me, first time every time. No. Maybe I should have done a video playing football on this. Would have made a very good thumbnail, wouldn't it? So the builders have just gone home. Let's do some skills. Take a look at the progress. The old sheds have gone. The level's all coming up. The only issue we have got here at the minute is um, we've, we've got a bee's nest just here. Um, so I'll, I'm not gonna get too close. One of the builders has already been stung. Oops, not my fault. We've got two brand new sheds coming in. Check this out, guys, look. It's looking so good. These guys have just started working as soon as I started filming. <laughs> <laughs> here they go. Nick's doing all the patio here, which looks pretty, pretty good, I have to say. He's a bit of a perfectionist, which I've heard. Ian, yeah, not so much, but he's doing the best he can. <laughs> yes, this is the membrane which goes underneath. So it's coming together, guys. Before, the level was like half a foot lower than that. And then the sleeper is in here, which kind of comes right across. And then we might have a little step down there, depending on what level they bring this up to. We've got the man cave, and then we're going to have the barbecue down here, some of the boys around. It's gonna be decent. The bee man's here. He's um, digging away. He's gonna, he's gonna save him. The patio is finally finished. I mean, I say finished, it's still gotta be grouted and there's a few other little fiddly bits that's gotta be done. But for the most part, it's pretty much done. The next stage is gonna be the exciting bit, getting in the artificial grass. I think it's about time we do that now. Look at that. Oh, wow. That's 
Artificial grass, I've just been told I've got to call it. It's not Astro, call it artificial grass, she said. Oh, she's not listening, she's ignoring me now. Um, so yeah, it's, it's already going down, which is great. Um, it's actually starting to rain, which is a bit of a nightmare, but look at this as well. I'm thinking this is going to be perfect to like play the ball off, you know, like and then turn and then whip the ball down there into... No? No, you're, you're not having any of that, are you? This whole thing is about me being able to play football on the most amazing surface. Everything's leveled, everything's flat, and I'm so excited to get this finally done. It's gonna look wicked as well when it's cut in around the corners and the angles and stuff. I cannot wait to see it. Yes, the garden is finally finished. Do you, do you want to see it? Do, do you? All right, have a look. So it's all done. And Kel, what do you reckon? Love it. She loves it. I love it. Joshua loves it. We are so happy. We've got some furniture in as well. Check it out. We've got the sofas. We've got the what? Cushions. We've got the cushions on at the minute, but it will have cushions on, so it will be a little bit more comfortable. Although, to be fair, it's not too bad. Is this right? Mm, not quite. One of my favourite little parts, come over here. Not the flower bed, that's... No, 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 we don't want to focus on that. That's Kel's little area. We spent progress. far too much money on plants. We bought loads, we thought we'd filled it, <laughs> and we've actually only got about 20% filled. The double egg chair, just for me. Joshua thinks it's a swing. He does actually, yeah, but this is super chill. Enjoy the garden. Oh. Butterflies just landed on you, Kel. Flipping heck. <laughs> That's a massive butterfly. Wow. Well, all are welcome here in the garden. It's a beautiful garden filled with butterflies. Quite relaxing. I think after we finish this video, we've done all this kind of content. Just need a little bit of time to just chill. The butterflies come back, Kel. I love you. Yeah, we decided to get this little corner area patio just for that, which I think works really well. Yes, this is what it's all about. Chilling in the shade with a lovely view and my wife. She is proper chilled over there now, isn't she? We were gonna have this egg chair over that side, um, but we've got kind of quite a few sets of furniture. So I think it works really well here. Kind of just frames the garden nicely as well. I'm super chilled, I might just go to sleep for a little bit. The artificial grass is so comfortable. Look, look at that. <laughs> You could do anything. Joshua does dive on it. Yeah, he does. And you know what? I just can't actually believe we've got a flat garden. It's just been so like up and down with a massive ditch where you are, Kel, right there for so long. And yeah. now it's absolutely perfect. It's no longer a swamp. It isn't, yeah. We lived with it for a swamp for, well, since we moved two in years. about two years ago. It was definitely due an upgrade. Come over here, guys. Now the kind of angles are cut in. It looks really nice. Cut in, cut in, cutting. Yeah, now they're cut in around the patio. That really stands out really nicely. This area wasn't really utilized before, but now we've got Joshua's slide here. We've got another area down at the bottom, as you know. My man cave's in there, which Kel's actually taken over and started to use as a lady cave. I'll probably do my barbecues from down here. Not on this, because that's not a barbecue. Two shows are better than one. It was either one big one, a wooden one, and we thought, nah. Why are you yawning behind the camera? I'm sorry. If you're yawning, they're yawning. They're going to be bored as well. Hopefully you're not bored, guys. That's all been done as well. Have a look at that. Look at that patio. They slaved over this. It took him about three weeks to do the whole thing. Um, and I'm really, really happy with it. I'm not happy with this gate, though. Right, quick go on the slide for me. No, I'll leave that to Joshua. Thanks, Mum and Dad, for that, by the way. That was... They said they wanted to get him a slide. It's a massive upgrade from the last one, which was about there. <laughs> They've jumped from a level one to a level 10. But he absolutely loves it. And all in all, guys, you know what? I am so happy. The setting here as well, backing onto the woods. Obviously, when the weather's good as well, it makes such a difference. We're going to make the most of this garden. We're going to absolutely love it. Barbecues, loads of parties. You're invited. Yes, if you're watching this, you're invited. You can come too. But anyway, I think it's about time we get the football out and try out the artificial grass. Oh, I love it. Oh, bad touch, bad touch. That wasn't, I can't blame now though, can I? The divots and the lumps and the fact it's not flat. The divots. 
Yes, Carl, that is right, isn't it? I thought you said divots. No, I didn't say divots, I said divots. <laughs> I can't blame any of that stuff now. It's purely down to my touch and how good it is. Look. <laughs> Whoa, I've got around that. Feels so nice, guys, I'm not gonna lie. Very, very happy with this. Oh! Oh! Careful of the patio doors. <laughs> Gonna be out here all day long. Just doing skills. Practicing that one that I still haven't quite got right. No excuses not to get out here now, all year round. Perfect conditions to practice my skills. And obviously film videos for you guys. I'm thinking, Kel, you know you got the flower bed done. I wasn't that fussed about it, but now I'm actually really happy about it. You know why? Why? Because look, it's perfect. These little passes off in all directions. I can do little touches there. I can work on my turn, play it into the middle. Play it into the side, come off there and shoot it. <laughs> you, know, you were just too slow on the camera work. Let me try again. Touch and turn, open up, mm -hmm. through there. You can't see the goal, I'm gonna see if I can bend it around there. Ready? Oh, that's looking very nice. Oh! It's hit the post. It just wouldn't go in. Absolutely ideal for working on those passes. There we go. Goal! And the slide. Step over. Come on the way. And turn. I really need some more practice. Feels so good. No, covered in mud. <laughs> Why are you wearing white socks barefoot? I don't know, to be honest. That's probably not the best thing. I'm still gonna have to put these in the bin, but it was so worth it just to show that I can be out here for the video. Yeah, go on. Good kicks. What have you got there as well? Oh, your bubble machine. <laughs> do you want to play some football or do you want to do bubble machine? Bubbles. Oh, bubbles, come on, that's not the right answer. Kick that football for me. <laughs> yes, what a kick, and again. Oh, yes. What's that? Oh, it's a leaf. Oh, Joshua, do you reckon you can kick the ball up into the egg chair? Big kick. A big one. A big one, yeah. Oh, that's the one we're talking about, high five. Yes, that was good. <laughs> nice. And again. Oh, he's sending me running over here. Go on, big kick, big one. Oh, that's brilliant, Joshua. That's it. Oh, all the way. Oh, and what do you say when you put it in? A goal. Gonna go down the slide? Yes. Or no, would you like to go down the slide? Oh, you wanna play bubbles? Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's see your bubbles then. <laughs> Oh, there we go! <laughs> yeah, go and catch them! Go on! Wow, that's a lot of bubbles. <laughs> Where, are you Where are you going? Mate, you're so fast now. <laughs> Favourite game? <laughs> We do this a lot, guys. It gets extremely dizzy, but we just keep going. So there we go then, guys. That brings us to the end of another video. So this video, yeah, it was pretty different for my channel, but I wanted to kind of show you the transformation to show you what we've got now, which is absolutely amazing. We've been so blessed. Obviously, the Euros were incredible, um, but it was kind of annoying not to be able to be out in the garden filming videos here while that was kind of taking place because it was just a total mess, it was carnage. But now the finished product, the finished article, we're so fortunate and we're so blessed to be able to have it. Thank you to you guys for your support. Obviously, I was able to pay for this with some of the revenue that I got from the Euros content, which was absolutely amazing. So stay subscribed, stay liking, stay commenting. Loads more videos coming soon. Let me know in the comments if you'd like to see me make a proper video here in the garden, like a 1v1, maybe like, a, like a, a tournament football battle with some of my mates. That would be the kind of content that I'd love to do, but let me know in the comments if you want to see it, and I'll make sure I can do that very, very soon for you. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.